What's up, YouTube? I did the uh, Google search myself. Matthew 28 changed. I'm going to search the link so you can check it out. Scholars such as F.C. Coney Bear have claimed that the Trinitarian baptismal formula of Matthew 28 19 was not original to the text of Matthew. Imagine that. In other words, was the phrase in the text in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit inserted at a later date? Says, for example, by the First Council of Nicaea, 2325 A.D. The correct reading of Matthew 28:19 appears to be in Luke 24:47, and that repentance and remission of sins should be preached in His name. That's the name of Jesus to all nations beginning at Jerusalem. Matthew 28, Luke 24, Mark 16, John 3, the Great Commission. And how did they implement the Great Commission? And they're talking about the Great Commission on this. Repent and be baptized, every one of you, in the name of Jesus Christ, for the remission of sins, and you shall receive the gift of the Holy Ghost. That's the Great Commission. That's how you get into the kingdom of God. Try telling this to all the uh, deceived um, denominations. They'll be like, what? That's why I make all these videos. I wonder if they get any other cool stuff I could share with you. Uh, yeah, there's all kind of stuff here. Let's see. Since something like the full text of Matthew 28, 19 is found in the Diadec, 80, 50, 70 at the earliest, and generally early 2nd century at the latest, it is alluded to twice by Tertullian in, on baptism and uh, praxis. I don't know what they're saying. There's a lot of stuff going on, folks. Now, now I I can teach. I have taught. Uh, it's going to be a chapter in my book, Matthew 28:19. It says name. I mean, you know, what what they're. Even though the the corrupt uh, Trinitarians, you know, they were called the Universal Church, the Catholicism. You could Google it, Universal Church. So, and they had a triad even before the Christian one that they uh, invented, you know, according to history. Um, I think it was Mercury, Apollos, or I don't remember, Venus. But uh, all the nations had trinities, okay? So if you if you understand all this stuff, and the Shema law of Moses got as one, not to be ever broken. So that, that stands today. Jesus Christ is that embodiment of Jehovah, Jehovah Jesus. You know, Isaiah, Father became the Son, Jehovah Jesus. Jehovah Jesus, Father became the Son, Jehovah Jesus. See, Christ means Father and Son. Okay? So you're not confused, you're not deceived. Follow the biblical apostles. Get baptized in Jesus' name, get filled with the Holy Ghost, and you're going to be safe in God's hands. Okay? Uh, away from the Antichrist spirits of religion. Okay? God bless you. Check it out. Google it. I'm going to, I'll put the link on the video. God bless. Again, Matthew 20 and 19, corrupt Catholic monks inserted, uh, falsifying the, uh, original text of Matthew to confuse, to deceive, to try to implement their trinities, okay? They inserted it, and that's why all these crazy, you know, people that don't know any better, and the uh, whatevers, that's why they do what they do today, okay? It's very prevalent. It's all around. And whereby we know that it's the last time there's many antichrists, and antichrists shall come. John was saying they're going to creep into Christianity, this pure Jesus name baptizing church, and they're going to come and say, oh, and, you know, and they're going to try to hijack it and take it over. And even now are there many antichrists, okay? So be aware. God bless you.